Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. My name is Eric Ray and sitting next to me here on the commentary gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham United midfield man Stuart Robson. And what we have coming up for you is live action from the Saudi Pro League. Stuart, what are you expecting? Yes, thanks as always Derek. We've got two good teams here so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Well, as far as the visitors are concerned, this is an exceptionally leaky defence. And Stuart, something they're going to have to address. Yeah, away from home, they've looked so poor defensively. The front players don't press the ball, the midfield players get outrun, and the defenders have made too many bad mistakes. It needs to improve today, otherwise they get nothing from this game. This is the lineup for the home team. Well, it looks as though they're going to go with a 5 4 1. But the wing backs will get forward when they can, and the two wide midfield players will join the striker, which would then make it a 3 4 3. And introducing the visitors' lineup today. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4 5 1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And now they get the ball rolling. And out of play, the pass nearly worked out, but not quite. Tawamba he continues his run can he put it away but can't avail himself of the chance will he be disappointed with that maybe it's just come a bit too early for him Mitchell to Freire and a strong tackle Tawamba the cross is on in position here to protect the ball might go ahead still could be dangerous but no the flag is up and it's offside Good movement. Tawamba. Can they forge ahead? And possibilities here. Well, a top-notch piece of defensive judgment. And breaking at pace with Menace. Well, an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Tawamba. Fatty. And he's won the ball. Medran. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. 
Well, they've given him too much space. Can he get them in front? Really vital interception here. This might be ideal for the counter. Well, it petered out. Teammate available. And the keeper caught there. Well, they fancy a short one. Medran. It's with Nui and Dama here. And reading it absolutely superbly. Well, the referee not too happy with the challenge and blows for a free kick. And perhaps a bit fortunate not to be shown the yellow card. Different story next time, no doubt. Getting in there to intercept. Well, the visitors have controlled possession, as you can see, but without really creating too many chances. Which, when you look at the players out on the pitch, it's really disappointing. They need to play with far more urgency to win this game. Tawamba. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Medran, superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Oh, moving it nicely. Oh, a goal! And every player's worst nightmare, because this will go down as an own goal. Well, here it is again, and quite clearly, that's an own goal. He's a bit unfortunate, really. Well, that own goal has put them behind. Well, just one minute of time added on for stoppages here. So there goes the half-time whistle. It is an acceptable scoreline from the point of view of the visitors. They find themselves on top, Stuart. Well, Derek, that's so much better. They look well organised, they've been alert to danger and their work rate has been excellent. That's a really good first-half display. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Medran. And here's Tawamba. It looks promising. Happy to take on the shot. Just made sure nothing came of that. Mitchell to Freire. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Looking for that final pass and for that chance to level the game. Keeper getting the touch. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Well, still behind here, but only due to some incredible goalkeeping. Surely it's only a matter of time if they keep piling on the pressure like this.
Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Medran. And moving the ball nicely. Not the pass he had in mind. Really good interception. Chance to do damage. Can they get in behind them? And a chance to level it. Well, the goal was at his mercy. Well, it certainly was. He has to score there. And time for the change now. Fatty and into the last 20 minutes and there the attack ends for now Amin Atushi And very deftly cut out. An attack full of promise. And reading it absolutely superbly. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. It did look on for them, but not to be. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Zay Luis foiling them effectively Medran and he's gone for power so close to finding the net Substitution time it is. Five minutes to go. Well, they no longer have the ball. St. Louis. Now just the tackle that was needed. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. How can they turn one of these attacks into a goal? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Well, they may have the worst defence in the league, but today they work so hard all over the pitch to keep that clean sheet. That was about the best I've seen them defend, and it helped set up a really good victory.